I was suddenly interrupted, but I continue with parking the telescope. I find a suitable position here, slew the telescope. And and I will park it. I will uh, then show you how to make a T-point model. Of course, when we make a T-point model, we must have a, the the clock on the computer must be correct. And it's very important to have a very good polar alignment of the telescope to begin with. Okay. Telescope. Telescope. Options. Park. Okay. It will now park. And uh, I will save the data of the Sky 6 into a new name, which I will use for this new T point model. So I save it like a file, save as, I can choose April 2012, save, okay, and I have this uh, this here is the old here is the old T point well. I will uh, delete this one. So. I delete this one, yes, I'm sure. Okay, now uh, the old T point model is removed. And I have, and this is uh, version April 2012. So changes. Yes. So what I start is a program called T point. Ah, uh, so. Software BISC, T point, launch, launch T point. Okay, no points. Okay, this is also a standalone program, but I will use it in together with the Sky 6. Okay, what I do now is start is. Okay, I start the Sky 6. Okay. Link to the telescope. Establish link.
and I go to a bright star. I will get to So I find Capella here. I flew to Capella. I will probably not find it when I take a picture because I have not established a T point model yet. Okay. So this is interesting. Now I check if I can find it. One moment. I will I will now take a picture of this star. Well, I took a picture, but uh, I did not see the star. So I go to the Sky 6 telescope, motion control, and I use the jog options. I can use. Yeah, five minutes. And I try to find this bright star. I search for it. First I search east. Two times. And I take a new picture. I must find it. Then I know how much... Uh, the pointing error is okay. I take a new picture. Hopefully, I will soon find it. Interesting. Okay, I just keep on searching until I find this bright star. Yes, I find it clicking two times, so I must, then I will center the star, and I remember how far I moved the telescope. Taking a new image, then I just center the star very careful. Yes. Okay. I now use uh, one minute, one minute move of the telescope. It's probably one arc minute. Uh, three times. Not one time. And I take a picture. Yes, that is very satisfactory. Okay. Then I then I will uh, then I will 
include this star in my t-point model. This is the first star. Okay, I just check in my manual, to be honest. I choose edit, insert, new object, and I choose t-point modal. Okay. And I click on the star I have, that is Capella. And I click on the on this icon here, which will map this star. Confirm map. Yes. Okay. So I have my first star in my T point model. I will now flew to this second star. I know the telescope will miss the star, but I know which direction I need to slew the telescope to correct it, to find the star. Uh, no correction yet, sorry. Okay, I remember what I did. I used five minutes west. One minute north. Okay. I take a new image. Hopefully, I will get it. Downloading. Yes, I got it. Barely. I have it from Okay. Now I only need is to send the star. So, just one moment. Yes, now I have centered the second star only using the motion controls for the telescope, and I will do the same with four more bright stars. One moment. I will do this without recording. Yes. I need I I need to map it first. Again. I map this second star. Okay, so you see I have two stars in my model. I need six stars before the T-point model go to action. So I just continue. Please be patient. I will do this on my own and come back. Okay, I have mapped four, uh, excuse me, six stars, and uh, now the T-point model should start to work. I can try to slew to a uh, By the star, Mitzar, in the Big Dipper, 
will samai us will samai us and will and we will now see if if the telescope find the stars and how good it is positioned i take a image hopefully it will be not so far from the center well i see nothing i just wonder why i uh -huh. need some contrast <laughs> i just start to wonder for a moment okay it is not perfect but good enough for my purpose but i can improve the model by using this 